Hi, my name is Peter Vogel, and in this video we're going to learn the basics of reading tablature. Tune your guitar and let's get started. When you look at the page, when you see the tablature staff and the notation staff, the treble clef is going to be above, and then you'll see the tablature staff below. The bottom line on the tablature staff is the sixth string on the guitar. As you go up to the line right above that, second from the bottom, that's going to be the fifth string. Line above that is the fourth string. The line above that is the third string, then the second, and then the first. So looking at the page, the bottom line on the staff is the lowest string on the guitar. The top line is the highest string on the guitar. So if you look at example two, and all we're really worried about here is the tablature staff. You don't even need to look at the treble clef above it right now. So the tablature staff, you'll see a zero on the bottom line. That means an open sixth string. So you're just going to play the open sixth string. That's all it's telling you to do. When you go down to example three, you're going to see zeros across all of the, the lines on the tablature. So zero sixth string, zero fifth string, zero fourth string, zero third string, zero second string, and zero first string. I just think of those zeros as an O, as in an open string. That's going to help you remember that. So that's all we're worried about in example three. Going on to example four, you're going to see a one on the bottom line. That's the sixth string on the guitar. You'll see a two after that. That's the second fret on the sixth string on the guitar. Then you'll see a three, third fret on the sixth string and then a four, which is the fourth fret sixth string. So what we're seeing here is one, two, three, and four. Notice there's nothing on the page there telling you what fingers to use. All this is telling you is what fret to play. So that one means first fret on the guitar, the two means second fret on the guitar, the three means third fret, and the four means fourth fret. This isn't talking about fingers. The numbers on these lines represent the fret to play on whatever string they're located on. So one, two, three, and four. That's example four. Going on to example five, you're going to see the same thing, but this time it's on the fifth string or the second line from the bottom of your tablature staff. So it's first fret, that's what the one means, then two is second fret, the three is third fret, and the four is fourth fret. So once again, keep in mind, these aren't talking about fingers, these are talking about frets. That's what the numbers represent on the lines on the tablature staff. Example six, you're gonna see a two, that's on the bottom line, that's the sixth string on the guitar, then a two on the fifth string, a two on the fourth string, a two on the third string, two on the second, and a two on the first. So example six is just playing this. And all we're learning from this is that the two or the number on the line represents the fret in which you play. And this is the second fret on the guitar, this space. So that's where you're gonna play that note. Example seven is a well-known melody that I use with a lot of my clients to make sure they can read tablature and it's a little fun for them to play. So if they've never read before, this is a great test to make sure that they know what they're doing when they look at the tablature. It starts off with two zeros or two O's on the sixth string. So you just play those. The four is the fourth fret on the sixth string. Notice it's still on that sixth string or the lowest line on the tablature staff. Then you're going to play a two, only this time it's on the fifth string or the second line from the bottom. Then you have an O or a zero on the fourth string. It's one line up from that two. You're going to the fourth fret, because that four is still on the fourth string. Then it goes to a two, second fret on the fourth string, and then an open fourth string. 
So in example seven, it sounds like this. You probably recognize that melody a little faster pace. And what you want to know is these numbers, the main thing you're learning here, represent the frets to play. I'm just using whatever fingers I feel like using right now because there's nothing on the page telling you what fingers to use. It's just what fret to play and what string to play. The great thing about tablature, unlike note reading, is it tells you exactly where to play whatever it is you want to play on the guitar. And if you're familiar with the melody or what it is you're working on, it really helps as well. Well, that's our lesson for today. I hope you learned something new. My name is Peter Vogel, and I will see you again soon.